Hey, what is up guys? This is iTechSpot here and welcome back to a brand new video. Today, I'm going to be showing guys an updated video on how to get all emulators on your device without a jailbreak. So let's get started. So the first thing you guys want to do is head on to Safari right here. And once you guys are on Safari, you guys want to paste in this link, which will link down below in the description box. Once you guys are here, what you guys want to do is tap on install app. And once you guys tap on install app, you'll see it loading right here. And now you guys will see this prompt which will pop up and you guys just want to tap on install. So you guys want to head into your home screen and you guys will see the application loading right here. And I'll be right back once this is done downloading. Alrighty guys, so the application has failed. So this is normal. So what you guys want to do is tap on retry and you guys want to head into settings right here. Once you guys are on settings, you want to go down to general, scroll down into date and time and you want to set your date back to July of 2014. Alrighty guys, so I've set my date back to July of 2014, so you guys could choose any day. And now what you guys want to do is tap on the application if it hasn't installed already. And the application should fully install on your device. Alrighty guys, so the application has loaded right here. So if we tap on it, it'll say untrusted developer. So what you guys want to do is head on to settings right here. And you, you guys want to set automatically once again. You guys want to go into profiles and device management. And you want to go into the developer you guys want to tap on trust and trust the application so now if we go into our home screen right here and we tap the application you'll see this prompt right here it'll say the application is no longer available so this is the only downside about this application that you guys could only play this game when the date is set back to july of 2014. so in order to open up the application what you guys want to do is head back to settings go back into general so right here, scroll down to date and time. You want to turn off set automatically and go back to July of 2014. All right, so I set my date back to July 2014. You guys should be able to open up the application perfectly fine. So here it is, guys. The application is running. Now you guys will see this prompt which will pop up and it says new version available. You guys do not want to update. So you guys want to tap on no. Now you guys could head into categories. And once you guys are on categories, you guys could see all your emulators right here. So we're just going to test out a game. So you guys want to tap on this right here. So we're going to tap on this game right here. All right. So we tapped on this game right here. We're going to tap on the download button right there. And the application should begin downloading. So the download speeds are very quick. So just wait for it to download. Alrighty, guys. So the application has finished downloading on my device. So we're going to tap on it to play. All right. So we're going to tap on that button right there. And as you guys can see here, the application is launching perfectly fine on my device. Now, before I wrap up this video, I want to show you guys how to open up the application. So in order to open up this application, what you guys want to do is make sure your device is set back to July of 2014. And if not, you guys could set this back to automatically. But you guys want to make sure the application is still running on your multitasker view. So you guys could still open up this application with the multi multitasker view on. So make sure you guys have this enabled. You guys cannot access this with the home screen. You guys could only access it through the multitasker view. So I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Feel free to comment down below if you run into any problems. Also, don't forget to like up this video since it helps out the channel so much. And feel free to subscribe since I'll be posting videos every single week. Anyways guys, this is iTechSpot and I'll catch you on the next video. Peace.